So, like I was saying, like, <laughs> I'm not mad at her. I'm not. I literally just been asking her this shit for the longest, man. Like, like. Yeah, I was mad, you know, some shit where it's like, like, why, like, why do I even have to ask you to choose me? You know what I'm saying? That's the type of shit that make me mad. It ain't, not that I know the truth, I'm good. Like, you know, because I was worried about my pride, like, my, 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 <laughs> It was fucking with my pride and my ego. Like, I was insecure about shit. And I ain't never been that type of person. You know what I'm saying? So, you know. Just ain't never been that type of person. Um, and it's crazy. She told me she still want me, but she still want him too. <laughs> I don't work like that, Shawty. Nah. And now that I know she's still on that shit, it's like, bitch, I mean, fuck you forever, Kaja. Like, i never forget her for this shit. Like, put it like this. I never let her live it down because it's your baby daddy. You know what I'm saying? And you could have told me the truth from the jump. You not knowing. And I really love your ass. Like, like I don't even know if she do know. Like, I don't know how women can see that somebody, like, genuinely love them. And just keep laughing in their face. You know what I'm saying? Like, is it a thing of, like... Because I done had people that just be like, they like me, and they infatuated with me, but I don't really, but I can't fake it either. You know what I'm saying? So that's why it's like, with her, it's like, it's like you're not faking it, but, you know, it just, I don't know, it's just too much confusion. It's just always too much confusion, bro. Like, I honestly thought we was better than that. Like, and I never let her live it down. Like, we get, like, like, that's why I don't fuck with Seven no more. Like, like, ignore me. Like, I was there for her while I was homeless, my ex. And she still was like treating me like shit. I would hate to think that my girlfriend, my ex, would catch her jealous of me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I would hate to think that. Cause like, it's like every time I bring this shit up or I used to bring it up, she'd be like, you got your turn, you got your mama, you got, you, you, this, that. And it's like, no, I don't. Like, what, what is, what argument is this? Like, you never see me around my mama, you never see me around my children. Like, and you my girlfriend, you should know what's really going on in the house. You don't know. Because every time some shit happened between me and my mama, I can't call her. Bro, I wish I would have documented. I think I did, but I didn't do a clean documentation. You know what I'm saying? Like, to document every time some shit happened between me and her. Like, and I'm kind of glad I didn't because now that I know that I wasn't tripping all that time, it's like, I wouldn't want that shit to be seen. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't go back and look at that shit and show people, like, what the fuck I look, look what I. <laughs> This shit is embarrassing. You know what I'm saying? Just like the other night I rented a car for like $60. Rented a car. Only 
only place I wanted to go was to a hotel and stalk her. She just moved. And moved to another room. I got the video of me there. Like, I might post it. Only, I think I'm only going to post it if I just want to delete it out of my phone. But I got the video. Like, and it's like... So, you know, knowing that I, I'm, I'm, I'm stuck on her even after she missed every holiday this year, missed my birthday, missed my daughter's birthday. Even though she did all that shit, I'm still trying to contact her you know, and show up just to have a conversation, because I wanted to have, she went to my phone call, so I wanted to have a conversation. And, you know, just like this morning, I sent her a couple messages, uh, just like good morning messages, because yesterday we kind of made up. And, um, Sure enough, like I said, even when I made the video last night, I enlisted it, but I'm going a, I'm to a unprivate the video I have put up last. It's a short, you know, I made her blush last night, and I knew that I had her. Like, she ain't going nowhere. But that's the thing, like... To know I'm a side bitch, bro. That shit, like, I got this bitch name tattooed on me and everything. And I ain't ashamed about the tattoo, because I really thought we was going to get married, bro. did. No, so I'm not ashamed about the tattoo. Shit. I got seven tattooed on me twice. And I'm not ashamed. Like, I'm thankful for the relationship. And it taught me so much shit, but like, I honestly, y'all, can't believe she gone, right? And I just found this last night. This all the ponytail she be wearing. If y'all see the last video we got together when we was out doing the mukbang, and we went to the casino that night. Why she got all the videos? Like, I don't have no videos of us actually having fun. Like, like cause that little restaurant was just like a little diner downtown. It's expensive, but it don't look like shit. One number of white people in that bitch. But, uh, it's like a white people soul food restaurant, but I ain't mad at it, bro. Like, I'm hurt, caboodle, but I ain't mad at her, like, she knows she's stupid, you know what I'm saying, she knows she fucked up, she done admitted to it, she done cried to me, admitted to it. I just kept letting her play in my face, talking about they roommates and this, that, and the third, this, that, and the third. Well, it fucked me up, so she called me not too long ago. I was texting her around 10 or 11. I only sent her two texts. Sent her that good morning text, and I sent her another text. 
of a video I was seeing that reminded me of how we is out together. And she called me on Messenger. And like instantly, well not instantly, A big dumbass. You don't. You have seizures. You don't even supposed to have no fl- flickering lights in your face. This is it, man. She, she do some dumb shit. Like, come to think about it, that shit ain't even good for her health. But she had some LED lights on her bed. First thing I thought, if you watch my, if you go back and look at my video. Uh, I don't know. I don't even think I posted that video. I may post it. But I asked her when we was getting married. She said, soon. And she been, you know, I been asking her a little shit. And it seemed like, you know, that she really would want to, like, move in with me type shit. But I'm forgetting my point, like, what I'm saying because I keep... I'm, I keep being blowed by the shit that I'm saying. Like, the shit that I'm saying is making me mad. Like, it's making me think about other stuff and getting distracted. Like, bitch, how could you do that? <laughs> but, okay, so I just felt some type of way about the LED lights. Like, you getting comfortable. You're, you, first of all, you just moved out the other room into that room, and you didn't move in with me? Okay, so I see a type... Oh, and then I hear his punk-ass baby in the background. So you really over there playing house. So I just bust out, like, crying. I wasn't, like, boohoo crying. I was boohoo crying, but it was just like, just like how I did a second ago. Like, it was just like, tears was running down my face, and I was like, I couldn't stop it. I just couldn't stop the tears. I asked her what's wrong with her. She crying too, cause I, cause I was, so I was like, I know why I'm crying. Why are you crying? And she was like, Don't worry about it. And that shit pissed me off because it's like, I'm just tired of that immature ass shit, like not being able to communicate type shit. Like, bro, if you don't, like, it's like, if you, if you don't trust me by nine, if you, it's like, the way she behaves is not the way I expect somebody that wanna marry me behaves. That's another reason. Like, when we're together, things are good. She a little standoffish. Now I know why she stand out, cause she used to be in lovey dovey with him. She don't be lovey dovey with me. She don't never be a fucking around me. So I don't know, like I don't know, bro. Like after I went to jail that time, not the last time, but that time. After her mama passed. While I was locked up, she was fucking with her other baby daddy. And she still fucking with this nigga. That's the crazy thing. Like, that's why she's choosing to be with Herman. Because he gonna let her do whatever the fuck she wanna do. And she think I'm dumb. Like, I know. I know what's up. Why don't y'all, why don't y'all think that I'm more like, like, of course this shit tears me up from every angle of my soul. But I've been, I've been telling myself, like, I've been reading the signs for so long. It's not a situation where I'm just like fuck the world coming to an end. No. I've been having having hella movement lately. I'm just finna move the fuck on. Like, because it's not a situation of I know she loves me. You want to live. You're living what you've been living with him. 
you with him. I'm not finna be no side bitch. I can't do it. I'm thankful that I know the truth. It's not that big of a deal. I promise it's not. It's not that big of a deal. I mean, my children not attached to her. Her children not attached to me. It's not that big of a deal at this point. Like, I feel like I'll be able to move on from this quicker than even with seven. Because, tell you, I've been meeting hella women. Honestly, if the women not even in my city, honestly, I'll be put like, I ain't met no bitches in my city. Every bitch that be wanting to talk to me and like be, be liking on me, be out of town. Mississippi most of the time, Louisiana, Florida. So like, I mean, and then it, like the last, like the video I just posted, or where it looked like a screenshot or some shit, where I say, uh, when you find out that she really loved that nigga, <laughs> and I went through deleting everything. In that video, you'll see like what I'm talking. See what I'm talking about. Like I talk to these women, and they really be liking on me. But then when it come time to talk on the phone with them or have phone sex or I don't know, just be on some flirting shit where I'm calling them bae and it, like you never get to that point. I never get to a point where I call them bae or um, just want to be with them. Like I never, it's one girl, no two girls. But then, it's two girls that I considered doing it with. But the first woman, I already made up in my mind, I wouldn't want her over my girlfriend anyway. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't, that's not, it just, it just wasn't my type. You know what I'm saying? So, like she was fine as fuck, like, Big ass, pretty ass, boobies. A little tattoo on her breast. I'm talking about big ass. I'm talking about thick as hell. Red. Uh, that's another thing. I don't like red women. I like rim women. I like chocolate women. They could be lighter than me or darker than me, but I like chocolate women. And, um,. And that bitch was from Haiti. Well, her family, she was a Haitian. Fine as fuck. But anyway. But honestly, to me, she wasn't cuter than my girlfriend. People, other people thought she was, but not to me. And plus, <laughs> it don't matter who that bitch get with. She gonna always be mine. You know what I'm saying? Like... It don't matter. She don't always be my bitch. Always. That's why I don't even trip. Like, even when I see dude, I don't trip. Because I've already told myself, just like on the video that I'm going to post. I'm going to post it. The other day, I walked in and I walked out, walked in the lobby and I walked out. He was standing right there. Walked right past his ass, walked in the lobby. Walked back out, he had the door open like he was going to come in. So I walked past him while the door was open. And he was like, what you doing here? And he was like, you know you're supposed to be here. And he said, don't come back. And I said, I'll be back. That's all I was saying. Because I was walking out, nigga, ain't nobody stung your ass. Then another thing, me and him used to talk. We ain't never fucked, but we used to talk. So it's like. You just petty. Like, I, I mean, even for that reason, I feel like it's crazy betrayal because it's like I've accepted y'all's relationship when we was together together. You know what I'm saying? Okay, that's your baby daddy. Cool. I accepted y'all's relationship with all that. Like, I wouldn't, I don't know hater shit. 
I did one time when he she had his fucking cash out because I'm like, first of all, bitch, how the fuck you get his cash out card? You know what I'm saying? So it's like, and that was when we was living together last summer. She had his cash, and I'm like, she was like, oh, I forgot I had a uh, cash out. Or somebody, I don't know, because I, I remember asking her, who cash up? She was like, Herman. And I'm like, why? Like, why the fuck do you, why? Bitch, what? <laughs> like, too many slip-ups, bro. That ain't, she ain't slipping up because she ain't on point. She slipping up because I'm a fucking, I'm a fucking, I'm me. I'm a communication guru. I'm a Gemini. I got clear audience. I'm psychic. All this shit. There's so many reasons why. You know, it's like, it's just like, it's just so many reasons why. Like, from jump, spirit been telling me. You know she with that nigga, right? Even to the point where Thomas one time, he was like, the first time he tried to tell me, he was like, you know what? I know you don't want to hear this, but I don't even give a fuck, so. <laughs> I think she with him. I think they together. And I was like, nah, bro, like, not, nah. you know, I was just so in denial. Like, Just so in denial. I know one thing. I got a new fuck partner if I wanted one. I know that much. I got, I know exactly who. I got two, actually. <laughs> I forgot about that. I ran into a little shot the other day at a plasma summer. She was, uh, she wasn't even giving plasma. She was dropping, dropping uh, her brother off. Well, she was there. She was waiting on him, too. But, yeah, I got a couple of bitches. I got a couple of bitches. I mean, but at the same time, I don't even want them hoes. Like, not like, like, you know that feeling when you're going through a breakup and it's like, I want to move on, but you scared that the connection is not going to be like, because you kind of still miss the person you just got out a relationship with. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, I don't know, in a way, it kind of be feeling like you being unfaithful. You know what I'm saying? Like, you, it's like you switching your loyalty over, but it still feel like you being disloyal. You know what I'm saying? And then it's like, bitch, why do you care? Like, why, why the fuck do you even care? So, yeah. Oh. Uh, I don't know, it just is what it is, man. Baby, let me ride and ride, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. I gotta find that video where I told everybody that Megan did that shit. Cause I told bro that shit the other night and he was like, and you the goat, you always be knowing when shit be, you like, you know, cause I be psychic, like, when people be talking, they, they give themselves away so easily. And then, like, you know you on point if you looking at somebody and you can hear their thoughts almost being like, you can tell by their body like or they, how their eyes look when they be like, I wonder if they know I'm lying. You know what I'm saying? I be looking for that look. I be, they do it every time. You got to look for that look. That look, you can even do it in my videos. I swear, you gotta look for that look, cause all humans lie. I don't give a fuck. Like I used to say, I don't lie, but sometimes I find myself lying, especially these days, because like dealing with this lying ass Scorpio. Now that I'm back lying, you know. <laughs> now that I'm back lying. You know, it's just been, I'm, you know, I don't know. It's just been a journey, bro. 
ain't even mad about shit no more. Like, I ain't mad. I'm not mad. Like, I mean, because in retrospect, she gave me the energy that I, I, I needed today. She told me. I was like, so you don't love me no more? She was like, yeah, I still love you. I just bought the ass on everything, though. I'm probably going to get some Benadryls and sleep my my little days away. You know, at least to probably, like, next month. And get my baby girl birthday out the way. Uh, And, yeah, that's all I really care about at this point. Cause honestly, that was gonna piss me out too. If she did something, if she went and celebrated our son's birthday without me, like that shit would have run. And all these little things that she be doing that made me know that she building a family with this nigga, it be pissing me. Like, I be wanting to beat that bitch the fuck up on God, like instantly. Like, it be like. Because when my son around me, he called me other mama. He called me mama. They both do. Actually, they both call me mama. They both done call me mama. Harmony be shy to, but she, because Jeremiah been around me way more. Harmony, but she did it last time she was over here. She was like, my mother. Like, they're my babies. But it's like, I'm actually thankful that we not as attached as like I would have wished that we was at this point because it's like damn your mama been doing this shit this whole time like see I'm the only type of person that I'm a strong believer of facing my emotions So that's what I'm finna do. I talk to y'all later. I done talk myself into crying at this point. So I'm finna go. I thought I was good. I thought I wasn't gonna need to cry. Like I thought I thought I was good. I thought, you know, like I was in a state of understanding and accepting what it is, but I'm really heartbroken by this shit. Like, it's so much time wasted. Like, she done wasted so much of my time. <laughs> Begging and pleading to be wrong. Like, the bond with my family. I brought up I want to take the shirt to the skate ring. She took her shirt, but they ain't even called me that day. Ignored my calls that day. So it's like where you went, you went to the skate ring with him. <laughs> like she showed me a video of her, of her brother skating, but you didn't show me no picture of you. And I know her. When she out having fun, she don't take pictures. I'm not, bro, I'm not stupid, bro. I know my bitch. Real niggas cry, bro. Cause real niggas know how to love a bitch, bro. Like, we not, might not agree about a lot of shit, this, that, and the third. But this what also scares me, bro. If she look at me, how I used to look at seven, then that's fucked up. Like, If, if so, spirit, I pray to God that we just able to go our separate ways. Because the way I look at Seven is like, I appreciate their relationship, but I don't want to be with nobody like that. Like,
Now I can start writing music, listening to music. What? Oh my god. I'm gonna turn the fuck. That's what I'm gonna do. I gotta blow my nose and spit, y'all. Hold on. Honestly, and that's what that's why I'm making these videos, y'all, because every time I cry, I keep having little cries like this. Like I be crying and I start talking to spirit while I'm crying, like saying the little shit that's on my mind. Like, I can't believe she'll do that shit. Like what the fuck? But then I just naturally suck it up. Like it's not even like I'm trying to stop crying. I don't care no more. As long as I figure out a way to stay out of depression with this shit, I'm good. Like, and I've been learning how to do that. I just, you see, well, if you used to fuck with me, was a motherfucker saying they gonna do something for me, and I expect it. You get what I'm saying? Like, and then they don't, and they be like, damn, then. I can't be a priority to you, like, and you not making me a priority, so it's like, what is the loyalty, like, where is the fucking, like, the realness of this relationship, like, this shit is a lie, it was all a lie, bro, it was a lie, every single ass part of it was a big ass lie, and I'm up here sleeping with her fucking uh, hair by my head. It's like a little clip on hair thing. <laughs> I found it. It was uh smushed, smushed up in my. I take my clothes off and throw them over there. I got a lot of shit over there, but shit's crazy, bro. But I digress. I'm telling y'all, like, I've been preparing myself for this shit for so long. Before I ever asked her the first time, it's either me or him. I decided right then. Well, Spirit had already told me and showed me, if you decide to leave this situation alone, that they was going to bless me tremendously. Like, if, if, if I figured out what exactly, like, Spirit was trying to tell me, if you figure out exactly what you want to do, and I was like, well, shit, I just need to figure out is she really cheating on me or not? You know what I'm saying? Or am I the side bitch? I just need to figure that little part out. Once I figure that out, then I can make my decision to, like, leave her alone completely. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, of course stuff will happen where, you know, this, that, and the third. But... <sighs> The reason she was unavailable, the first and the second, which was around the time I was trying to get stuff done for my daughter's birthday. The reason that she was unavailable was because uh, she was moving. They they was moving their little family to another room and setting up LED lights and shit. <laughs> that was the fuck they were doing. You know what I'm saying? Like, so. It is what it is. I'm a, uh, I know I got $50 to buy some coins. And I got $50 in my wallet. But I got $50 plus dollars. All I really got to buy is some weed, but I want to go buy some clothes. And tomorrow I'm getting some money. I was going to do a love spell on her. Um, after I got that money tomorrow, but I can't now. Like, <laughs> that's why this is the reason why I could never do it before. Every time before, like, one thing about it, two things for sure, I'm going to listen to Spirit, but I still put my shit, myself through some bullshit. Like, Spirit been showing me signs for the longest, bro. Just like, 
I don't even want to talk about it because I don't want to talk. Like, the goal is to stop talking about them. You dig what I'm saying? I'm supposed to really just be talking about me and how I'm feeling, you know? It's okay, bro. And he's so stupid too. I would call him, but fuck that nigga. I'm gonna let. Like, it's like, I think that he okay with her cheating. Honestly. I really do. I think he's okay with it. The goal is to stop thinking about it. Yeah. See? The spirit working right there. I'm already starting to reprogram my mind. Like, one thing I know about when you realize something you said that you don't want to think that way or talk that way, you got to reset it right then or, or remind yourself. You got to say it out loud, though. You got to, like, hold up. No, I am this shit. <laughs> I ain't stupid. I was played. Like, why well, I was just scammed the fuck. Like, I mean, I scammed her, too. Like, bro, I know this bitch ain't been wanting to be with me for the longest. Like, every time I'm with her, I'm telling myself, don't fuck this hoe. Don't fuck this hoe, bro. You put your mouth on her when you know she doing dicks. You know she doing dicks. You know she laid up under the nutsack every night. Don't put your mouth on this hoe. But she just so fucking fine. <laughs> She get it every time. She get the, she get it every time. You hear me? Like, every time. And I promise y'all I'm not mad at her. Cause like, I remember being breaking over seven. Like I used to, I wasn't mad back then either, actually. Like when I find, that's, that's what I'm thinking. Thank you, spirit. Because this is what I was afraid of. I was afraid that. She would leave me, and it would break me down because I never been left before. You know what I'm saying? But because you know, like when I left seven, I left. You know, and I didn't have like, yeah, I had a little thing like, well. I'd be reminding her, I'd say something that she say, like, just then I had said something that casually saying, like, you hear me? Like, I get that from her. And, like, since I, I pay attention to words, like, I'm going to always remind myself. As long as I say that, I'm going to always remind myself of where it came from. You know what I'm saying? And, you know... Yeah.